Update, the 2000s music world was dominated by dreamy pop artists and competing boy bands. Their music still resides on countless party playlists, but where are they now? We've listed some of the top artists and what they're doing today. Backstreet Boys, Nick Carter, Carter is currently under investigation for an alleged rape that took place in 2003. Melissa Schumann, a former teen pop artist from band Dream, filed a police report about the incident, People wrote in February. He entertained a solo music career, releasing his last album, All American, in 2015. AJ McLean, McLean released his first solo country song, Back Porch Bottle Service, on June 5. The track holds elements of his former pop style while paying ode to the electronic country style popular at the moment. Howie Dorau, Dorau married wife Lee Boniello in 2007. The pair has two children together. He has had a handful of television guest appearances. Kevin Richardson, married to wife Kristen since 2000, Richardson has been open about the couple's battle with fertility. He promoted his film on a similar topic if I could tell you, in an open interview about the hardships of infertility speaking with Entertainment Tonight. Brian Littrell, Littrell and wife Leanne Wallace, who married in 2000, have one child. Littrell spoke candidly about his son's heart disease in a 2016 interview with Entertainment Tonight. In sync, Justin Timberlake, Timberlake is boasting a successful solo career, most recently releasing his album Man of the Woods in February. Timberlake performed at the 2018 Super Bowl, Lance Bass Bass is an active LGBTQ and mental health advocate. He and husband Michael Tarchin are currently hoping for a child via surrogate. In June, he was featured in Audible's special The Path to Pride, J.C. Chazé. Chazé was most recently seen in film Opening Night, released in 2017, according to the Internet Movie Database. He still works in music, songwriting and producing for other artists, most notably, American Idol alum David Archuleta. He released a solo album in 2004 titled Schizophrenic. Chris Kirkpatrick, Kirkpatrick spent 2002-2009 voicing character Chip Skylark on Nickelodeon's Fairly Odd Parents, according to IMDb. He married Carly Skolodany in 2013, Joey Fatone, Fatone appeared in 2002's My Big Fat Greek Wedding and its sequel in 2016. He has extensive film and television appearances and is a part of the upcoming movie Church People, according to IMDb. Jesse McCartney, McCartney is still active in the music world, though his latest releases haven't warranted as much attention. He released single, Better With You, which has close to 6 million plays on Spotify. In 2014, he released the album in Technicolor. McCartney has been exploring the world and new avenues of expression in his free time, he told the Huffington Post in May. I've been traveling quite a bit. I've been exploring different creative avenues and not necessarily music, he said. I did a lot of like learning how to cook, learning how to barbecue, learning how to be a grill master. I've been doing music for so long that I've never really had a chance to go see the world without having to work. Aaron Carter, Carter entered rehab in September 2017, according to USA Today. Carter had previously taken an HIV test on the daytime television show The Doctors, which came up negative but drew attention to the drugs in his system. Carter tested positive for prescription drugs and marijuana. He had previously been arrested for a DUI. The former pop star came out as bisexual last August. Carter is still an active musician. He released his latest album, Love, in February. The album is a continuation of his 2017 EP release titled Love. Lil, Romeo, Romeo Miller can currently be found on MTV's X on the Beach, a reality show that creates a dating atmosphere while singles are surrounded by their single ex-partners. He continues to rap and releases music under his real name. Miller released single, Good, in April of this year, Teddy Geiger, Geiger came out as transgender, announcing her transition in October 2017 and began hormone replacement therapy in November, according to People.
Recently, Geiger appeared on the red carpet for the first time since transitioning. Geiger continues to write and produce with other artists, including pop sensation Shawn Mendes. This story has been updated to include information about Aaron Carter's new album Love, which was released February 16, 2018.